You're not just gonna have a bowl of gravy. No marshmallows, George! That's a great dish! <laughs> I might need to go lie down. A little bit ago, I set out on a mission. That mission was to find what the ultimate Thanksgiving food is. But how would I do this, you ask? Well, the same way you get any information. By asking on your Instagram story. I started by asking, what's your favorite Thanksgiving food? And then, once I narrowed it down to the best 24, I put them into head-to-head -head battles at random in an Excel sheet and started taking polls. The amount of people that voted and got really excited about the polls honestly took me by complete surprise. So if you voted, thank you so much for voting and sticking with me through this project. To participate in the next thing like this that we do, you can follow me on Instagram at The Glass Studios or with the link in the description. So without further ado, let's find the best Thanksgiving food. The first battle was corn casserole versus green bean casserole. I've never had corn casserole, but apparently it's like a squishy cornbread. So yum? Green bean casserole won this one for good reason. Creamy cornbread or crispy onion straws. Green bean casserole. Our next battle was ham versus mac and cheese. This one was hard for me personally because I like both a lot, but I don't really consider mac and cheese a Thanksgiving food. Like, I'll eat mac and cheese any day of the year, but if we eat in ham, ugh, it's a holiday. So anyway, mac and cheese won. Next! Fried turkey versus northern or Yankee stuffing. And to clear up any confusion, northern stuffing is made with white bread, where southern stuffing is made with cornbread. Fried turkey won this one, which kind of made me sad because in my opinion, stuffing, or as you say in the South, dressing, is better than fried turkey. Next! Southern stuffing versus pumpkin pie. I don't have a whole lot to say on this one because neither of them are that good, but southern stuffing won, which actually surprised me. Ambrosia, which is pretty much a fruit salad, versus Brussels sprouts. I personally like ambrosia a lot, but a lot of people don't. So Brussels sprouts won. Chocolate pie versus pecan pie. Both of them are just okay to me. They're both just super sweet, but chocolate pie takes the cake on this one. Get it? Cause it's a pie, not a cake. Turkey versus hash brown casserole. Turkey is generally the main dish at Thanksgiving, which is really weird because it's so hit or miss. Like a good turkey is amazing, but a bad turkey is like eating sandpaper. Although turkey did win over hash brown casserole, which is fair. Rolls versus brown gravy. Rolls absolutely destroyed brown gravy in the polls, which doesn't surprise me at all. Whose favorite Thanksgiving food is gravy? Gravy is something you add to your favorite foods. You're not just gonna have a bowl of gravy, unless you really know how to party. Yams versus mashed potatoes. I'm still not 100% clear what a yam is, but I included it anyway because I know a lot of people eat them. Anywho, mashed potatoes crushed it, as they should. Ah, what the heck, mashed potatoes are the ones I'm rooting for. Then of course the age-old debate of sweet potato casserole versus apple pie. I love apple pie. I like apple pie better than most cakes. But sweet potato casserole, ah, uh, ah, uh, mm, uh, come on, the marshmallows, no marshmallows, George. Sweet potatoes with brown sugar, cinnamon, butter, marshmallows, ah, uh, mm, uh, chef's kiss. That's a great dish. Sweet potato casserole is a dessert disguised as a side dish. Mwah, so good. Y'all voted for apple pie. Shame on you. Shame. Anyway, guess we should move on. Not like it matters. Pot roast versus cranberry sauce. You can probably see where this is going. Pot roast crushed it. And the final battle of the first round is cornbread versus white gravy. Cornbread won, as it should, because white gravy is best on biscuits, which is also not a Thanksgiving food. Round one is complete. Before we go into round two, let's hear a word from our sponsors. <laughs> Just kidding. I make these videos for free. 
Time for round two. Green bean casserole versus mac and cheese. I personally would go for the green bean casserole because I'll say it again, mac and cheese is not a Thanksgiving food. Anyway, mac and cheese crushed it again, moving on. With a difference of three votes, fried turkey beats southern stuffing. Not a whole lot to report there. Brussels sprouts versus chocolate pie. Yeah, chocolate pie won. But for the nine people that voted for Brussels sprouts, just know you're a legend. Next up is turkey versus rolls. This was a close call, but rolls ended up taking the cake. Too many people have just been hurt by turkey that's drier than the Gerudo Desert. Next! Mashed potatoes versus apple pie. I love them both, but I personally think mashed potatoes are the best Thanksgiving food. And apparently, y'all agree. Mashed potatoes wins this round. That's what you get for beating sweet potato casserole apple pie. Get out of here! Pot roast versus cornbread. If you voted cornbread, you not only made the right decision, you made the winning decision. That's the end of round two. We're gonna go right into round three. Mac and cheese versus fried turkey. Between the two, I'd choose mac and cheese, but in the context of Thanksgiving, fried turkey. Because mac and cheese is not a Thanksgiving of course. Chocolate pie versus rolls. I honestly thought this one would be closer, but no. Rolls wins. Nice. Mashed potatoes versus cornbread. Another one that I thought would be harder, but apparently wasn't because mashed potatoes crushed it. Yay! That's the end of round three, which means we have our top three Thanksgiving foods. Rolls, mashed potatoes, and mac and cheese. How did mac and cheese make it to the top three? Come on, guys. Mac and cheese is delicious. I love mac and cheese. But in the context of Thanksgiving, sweet potato casserole is so much better. I'm not mad. I'm just disappointed. We have three foods left, so the final round is gonna go like this. Mac and cheese versus rolls, then rolls versus mashed potatoes, then mac and cheese versus mashed potatoes, and whichever wins twice is the winner. If you still don't understand, don't worry. It makes sense. You can trust me with stuff like this. I'm homeschooled. First is mac and cheese versus rolls. The winner of this one only won by three votes. How could you vote for mac and cheese over rolls? I thought you loved me. But alas, tis not to be. It's okay, cause mashed potatoes can still win. Next poll is rolls versus mashed potatoes. Rolls win. Which means mashed potatoes can't win the crown, but rolls still can stop mac and cheese. The final poll is mac and cheese versus mashed potatoes. If mac and cheese wins, it wins the crown. If mashed potatoes wins, then the top three all won a poll and I honestly don't know what I would do at that point. Let's take a look. Well, it's official. Sweet potato casserole is the best Thanksgiving dish of all time. Everyone give it up for sweet potato casserole. Oh my gosh, we did it. We did it. Sweet potato ca- Mac and cheese is your favorite Thanksgiving food? Really? Where are y'all getting this mac and cheese that's so much better than all these foods? Well, there you have it. The most popular Thanksgiving food is mac and cheese. I might need to go lie down. Thank you so much for watching this video. I had so much fun putting it all together, and I honestly got more into this than the real election. So thank you for participating and voting and whatnot. Feel free to hit that subscribe button for much more fun stuff. I've got some great videos coming out very soon, so watch out for those. Until next time, see you later, mac and cheesers.